Uh, 926, welcome to uh, Bechta Restaurant. Uh, Mike Moffat is here, and Stephen Bechta, how are you? Good, how are you? Good to see you. Good Thank to see you, you fellas. What, what do you got going here? I know you got Arctic char over there, Mr. Moffat. I got Arctic char. So, uh, course one off our eight course tasting menu. Right. Arctic char sashimi. So sashimi being just raw, we found this beautiful char, so we didn't want to do anything to it. Right. So we're going to just start there. We're going to build some flavors around it and hopefully keep it nice and delicate and well-balanced. Gotcha. You mentioned the tasting menu, and that's a big new thing that uh, you got going on on Sundays, right, at Becta? That's it. The, while our tasting menu is sort of the signature way to, to dine at Becta, we have both a five-course and an eight-course menu. Yeah. Um, we're trying something fun right now. We're on Sunday nights in the wine bar only, so only five seats at the bar and ten seats in the back area. Right. No tablecloths. Just make it fun and accessible. We present you both blind tasting menus and allow you to order a la carte off them at a slightly discounted price. So 15, nice. 15 bucks a course, you can order two or three and just sort of make your own little mini tasting menu, have it very accessible, easy drop in and wow. you know, something really fun. And it's fun. in the bar area at the back. Exactly. That's a good idea. <laughs> I like, well, you do have the, uh, the full eight course or five course available. Absolutely, well, right? absolutely, yeah. yeah. And yeah, but we just wanted to make it more accessible. People often think that Becta is only a special occasion thing. And we want to remind people that no, you can just drop in. You can just have a, an appetizer or two glass of wine in the bar area and make it fun and easy. So, right, right. you know, on Sunday nights, the perfect night to do that. We're, yeah. we're already, you know, dressed in jeans and, and thinking about, uh, you know, the weekend. So why not? Exactly, exactly. It's time to relax and have a nice bite to eat and get your, uh, you know, your weekend over with and your next week started. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's that beautiful uh, char sashimi over. My God, that looks, that's a beautiful looking fish, eh? It is beautiful. Yeah, it's, uh, I mean, it's absolutely gorgeous. Salmon plus one and a half. Yeah, beautiful color. Yeah. Now, when you, when you, do you often cook char, and how do you do it? Do you uh, steam we'll it? Do, we'll do char. Uh, mostly what we'll do with it is we'll pan sear it. Yeah. Uh, leave the skin on. There's a nice fatty layer because yeah. of the cold weather. It's got a little fatty layer there. So we sear it. That fat tends to do what, like like a duck, it, it sort of stays there. So you get an interesting texture. The skin gets really nice and crisp. Right. And then, yeah, just to cook to about medium rare, it's beautiful. That's it, eh? Yeah. Just a medium yeah, rare. Yeah, any more than that, it starts to get fishy. and. Yeah, yeah. And dry, it dries out pretty quick, I find, yeah, like salmon, eh? Yeah, most char is wild, so yeah. it's got a lot less uh, fat than farm fish, yeah. so. That looks absolutely beautiful. Now, uh, you do have the new place over in uh, Westboro. Exactly, yeah. Right? We, we opened up a place called Gazellig, which is a, a Dutch word meaning cozy, warm, convivial, time spent amongst friends. Did you find that word? Uh, I didn't find that word. I lived in Holland when I was younger. And, oh, did and you? I just, I love the idea of it. The, the Dutch have such a great appreciation, as most Europeans do, for just this relaxed culture of, of enjoyment of everyday life. And, and the Dutch, a uh, very tolerant group. Right? <laughs> yes, yes, they yeah. are. <laughs> Ask him so, why I live there. <laughs> exactly. No, I loved it. And uh, but so I, I just sort of adopted this word, and uh, and you know that's what we're trying to create. It's a, just a great neighborhood restaurant. You know, it's not meant for any kind of special you know occasion out. It's just meant to drop in, and you know if you're in the neighborhood, walk over. Well, and, I know a piece of property came up there, so you snapped it up in Westboro, and anybody uh, who's in business should follow that lead. Um, but why did you choose Westboro? Why did you want to have a restaurant there? Mike and I both live there. You know, our kids are in school there, and we just feel really connected to the neighborhood. We love the people there. We love the neighborhood. We love the walking ability, and and I don't know, just the surroundings, the like-minded folks, the businesses there. It's it's, it's just great. A, it's a really cool place to hang out. I think. Yeah. You no, know? absolutely. So you know, both of us could walk. We we always drive to work, but we we could walk if we wanted to. And, yeah. You know. Maybe when the nicer weather comes. Yeah. I mean, why would you want to walk around in this? No. Hey? Not so much. No. <laughs> no. Okay, uh, we, I want to talk about Valentine's Day too, Stephen. I know uh, it is a special occasion, but as we were discussing earlier, one does not have to go out on the actual day. Yeah, one it, can make a plan to go another day. Yeah, it's like going on March break vacation. Definitely on March break. You you know you pay more yeah. money. It's a lot more hassle. There's all kinds of you know weights and stuff like yeah, that. Yeah. You know you can you can spread it out. Go on the 12th or the 13th. Go on the 15th or the 16th, and just you know have it be more special. You're you're choosing to celebrate Valentine's when it's it's appropriate and, <coughs> and uh, great for you, with your schedule. That's and right. So you know we we'll we'll focus on Valentine's and this celebration throughout the week. Yeah, it's Valentine's week now. <laughs> Dear God. <laughs> <laughs> Fellas, we'll be back later. We've got some duck uh, we're going to cook up later. Absolutely. All right. I'm going to try that sashimi in a few minutes.